y'all. Hey. What are God doing back? Come on over here and give me some sugar. Okay, come on, come on, hey. come on. Anyway, what the? I don't, what I don't, the? I'm what? not married to them, so I didn't, I didn't really kiss them. I just what? made them think I was going to. Don't uh, get mad. You, you realize that nobody's right there, right? I do. When this uploads, they're going to be there then, but they ain't right here right now. Everybody gonna be there. Well, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Stan Live. It's your girl, Lynette. Um, Random TV reviews. Let's go ahead and get the um YouTube jargon out the way. Yeah. If you are not subscribed to our channel, go ahead and do so. It's free. Doesn't uh -huh. cost you anything but your time. Yeah. Um, if you are already a family member, you coming back, welcome. I also have a question for y'all. Did this come up quick for y'all? Yes, it did. I ain't expect for it to come back on with it. Somebody told us at work that it was coming back on. We was like, nah. That's a, you that's a lie. Yeah. And we did the research and I was like, oh, because it wasn't for that. We, we would have missed it. Here. We, 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 we would have missed been it. Here. We would have missed it because everything comes back on in May. So we was figuring that Empire was going to come back on somewhere around, around vacation time. Yeah, around that time. So, but yeah. But, but we back. So. We're going to get right into it. We might do things a little differently. It's going to be more like a discussion, kind of of a recap. Just flow with we're us. Just, we're just going to do it do. our way. Like nobody else can do. Hey, we like Burger King. We have it our way. Is that mm -hmm. right? That's how they say it? Burger King, have yeah. it your way? Your way? You can have it your way. Bird in the cage. Um, We got delayed, Lulu. See, right now we're in between, Stanley said we're in between two channels right between now. Two channels, the White and, Lock and uh, Lucius. So, I really think Lucius is like 99% back. Um, the White is kind of in there air now, then conveniently. So, what had happened was, y'all know when we went off on break, um, Jamal had killed Councilman Tay Diggs. Mm -hmm. We got Andre that was having a whole relationship with someone that was in his head. That never existed. Um, and Hakeem got his baby back. So we started off kind of with seeing Jamal go through the motions of basically he shot somebody, killed him, and mm -hmm. he trying to figure out how to process all of this and whatnot. Um, he could still smell the gunpowder and mm -hmm. all of that. And I said, that is true. That is Anybody so true. that shoot guns, that smell yep. lingers yep. for Same. friggin' ever. Yep. So if you ever want to know why the cops can automatically go to the, the scene of the crime when there's a shooting, all they got to do is wind down their window. They're going to smell it. Yep. You know what I mean? That's even worse if you go to the range. You go to the range, it's something to behold. Yeah. Um, so then we got um, Lulu has sent um, Cookie a text. Cookie know right off the bat, the um the jargon, the lingo, all of that in the text was not, not Lucius of his dialect. Nah. So she tells um Thirsty, listen, Lucius missing, got this text, sums up. Yeah, we need to find him. We need to find him, and you know Thirsty. Yeah, I'm on it. He on it. I call you when I got some. Thirsty. I told you, I need him on my payroll. I need him on my payroll. I need Thirsty on my team, I'm trying to tell y'all. Man. So Thirsty and his ugly suit came back, came back with the laptop, and he was like, listen, I got a cousin that work in strange places. <laughs> he told me that the last place that he saw um, Lucius was at the place where Andre is at. Yeah. After that, everybody, look, everybody signaled on went dead. But I got a videotape. Just keep looking, keep looking, keep looking. They caught Claudia with a got doing, um wheelchair so now they know that claudia's got don't tell got him i'm just gonna say this right now if something happens to me mentally and i don't be thinking right and don't process stuff right don't put my in no facility because niggas can come in there and <laughs> steal me that's only on there it's only on there you sure about that because you know parts don't be too far off from real life you got a white woman that's been stalking you no, not yet, God. but it's possible. God darn it. God darn it. So we flip over and we see that Claudia got delayed Lulu pit bull chained to so a got piano. No piano. She got tasers. She got, um, what's, what's the things? What? Tranquilizer guns. I mean, she got all kinds of stuff rigged up. She done layered his music. music. Got some lights to flash. I'm like, what the? And got him in the cabin in the woods just like misery. Yep. I said, next day she gonna do, she gonna break his ankles. I mean, what's really going on? So, Lucius was like, listen, 
At the end of the day, you can do whatever the fuck you want to do with me. But Lucius is here to stay. And what you're not going to do is play me. And what you're not going to do is make me do things the way you want me to do things. Yeah. You don't know who you mess with. I said, Lulu, um, this ain't the time to, to be, get, get crumb. Yeah. You need to be nice. You, you need, need to play, to play the game. Yeah, you need to play the game so you can get loose. Yeah, make her think that you falling in love. Well, he did do he it. He kind of did it. He did it, but he moved on her too quick. That's a loop. You gotta, you gotta Lula. finesse. You gotta finesse her long Don't enough. Don't touch me. You know. Don't he, touch me. You gotta finesse her long enough. Don't touch enough. me. <laughs> so we she can take the chain off your goddamn foot. <laughs> He's like, Don't touch me. I can't do nothing this week. So, um, so in the meantime, in between time. Thirsty had um contact because you know they had a little talk with each other and they were trying to figure out who knew Claudia's whereabouts and they came up with how about that doctor that is her colleague but kind of like her friend slash therapist too let's get in contact with her yeah and see if we can figure out where in the heck she may be homegirl came through and she be she freaking she violated. spilled all the beans yep she violated In other words, yeah. everything the heifer it's crazy. She sung like a canary. Yeah. See her condition. Well, she said her condition make her perfect for this practice. I'm like, how? how crazy this? people can help people. I'm trying to tell you. Look at Dr. G on Married to Medicine. <laughs> Most crazy people are psychiatrists or sociologists. But like, like her colleague said, but she takes her methods just a little bit too far. And she gave her an example. There was a bus trip. <laughs> Somebody got hurt on the bus. Claudia moved in with the family, isolated the man from his wife, told him, say, we need to go away upstate. Mm -hmm. See, this is where we get the information about where he really was. Yeah. Upstate. And eventually, it went to shit. Yeah. So that's what Cookie was like, upstate, upstate, upstate. Thurston said, don't even think about it. I got this. I'll figure it out. He went on up there to the county. And went up in the computer system and found out that Claudia's daddy still had some property, a cabin in the woods. And he went ahead and ran Cookie that address. But he told Cookie, said, listen, I got to get some stuff straight. You wait for me and I'll go with. Cookie too, mm -hmm. God darn. Nah, she's I like, said, I got this. I'm going. Look, see, this will piss you off about some of us sometimes. We can get so cocky in our ability to handle ourselves in these goddamn streets that you don't realize sometimes when stuff is bigger than yourself. Yeah, especially when you're going on somebody else's turf. Yeah, you don't you never go yeah, by the turf by turf yourself. Turf by yourself. See, they know where all the hiding spots at. They know where all the weapons is at. They know how to take you out and nobody never know that you even came up there. Hello. Huh? I don't know nothing about that, but uh, I yeah. <laughs> you, you don't do that. Never. Yeah. That's in the code book somewhere. I don't know what page is on. So it's what called, section. it's right here. Called being black. Hey. <laughs> you ain't learned nothing else. You better learn some skit it's like the that. the black book. <laughs> For real? For real. I just thought about some of that black book. Wait, go ahead. Huh? Yeah. So, let's, let's knock Becky out the way real quick. Paul Becky. Paul Becky. She in the PN stage. Anybody's ever been pregnant, y'all know what that PN stage is. Um, she's in the bathroom every five minutes. Portia picked up on that thing real good, real quick. Followed her in the bathroom and she was like, look, is your bladder the size of a thimble or is there something that you need to tell me? Becky was like, you know what, Portia, I ain't got time for your skit. She said, Becky, is that a pregnancy test in your hand? She was like, girl, they ain't reliable. Portia said, no, 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 that guy though, Portia had about 12 pregnancy tests Not in her pocket. I mean, um, what a name? Becky. Becky. Had about 12 pregnancy tests in her guy doing pocketbook. And Portia was like, baby, let me come get you a hug. And Becky kept saying, I just need to wash my hands. I just need to wash my hands. <laughs> and I said, I feel her, baby. Boy, I wanted to hug her too. I said, baby, it's going to be all right. Because we just had this conversation with some with one of our good friends. Yeah. And, and we had to do that and be like, yeah. you know what? Close, too close to home. You're going to be all right. It's not the end of the world. Because right, her, her and J.B. Papa ain't even together right now. No, nah, he's supposed to be a Christian. Yeah. He's so, supposed to be so he came, open. So he came back to Empire because they invited him back to put down the track. And oh, he, he put he down the track. track. Yeah, he he wrote a new song. And you know what's gonna happen to her? 
she gonna have twins. You watch what I tell you. See, I don't know if we're going to get that far because Portia was um talking to Becky and Becky was like, you know what? This is not in the blueprint of my life. I never thought I would be a mother. You know, I work hard to get where I'm at in this in this career. I just I just can't see being a mom. And Portia said, so Becky, what you going to do? And she kind of gave her that look, look like, I don't know. But I don't I know, know, but I have a decision in my head. So I don't think she going to do it, though. I don't know. I don't think she gonna. And the reason that I say that she probably will is because Lee Daniels is very good at pushing the envelope to open up a conversation. And I could see him open up the conversation about um, women's well, rights and um, pro-choice and whatnot, which is actually a very good conversation to have. It is what it is. So we'll so, see. Yeah, so we'll, we'll definitely see. So we get a lot of flashbacks of Cookie's time in jail, which usually her flashbacks of her in prison don't really do much for me but this one did because it was the epitome of betrayal yeah. when you are ride or die for people mm -hmm. you put yourself on the line for them mm -hmm. but they never do that skit for you yep. how many of us have ever been in that situation so what had happened was you know, she's flashing back because everything is kind of going full circle right now. She's flashing back when she was in there and they were going to take down that guard, that rape pound cake, mm -hmm. took her baby away and all of that. So they had sat there and they had came up with this plan. They had a good um, plan too. Yeah, of how these people over here was going to cause a distraction. Pound cake had her a shank over there and she was going to get at old boy. Um, Cookie had a razor blade that she put under her tongue like Tupac when he had the nose ring. And we I don't know what we think about doing that skit back in the day. I did it one time and I was so scared to talk. Me too. Uh huh. <laughs> I sure did. And you remember you talking about it. Just as fat tongue as you can be. Uh huh. So when it came time to do the darn thing, everybody went in position. They caused a distraction. Cookie stood up. Pound cake sat down. Didn't even move. Didn't move. Look down, matter of fact, yep. like I ain't had nothing to do with this because what had happened was she done made a deal with do old boy off to the side. He told her, say, if you tell me what's going on ahead of time so we can get ahead of it, I'll let you see your baby. So she basically let Cookie get her tail whooped, yeah. get thrown in the hole so that she can be broken. And this is where it comes to the part where it was relevant because... Cookie took God doing tail up there to the cabin in the woods by her God doing self as Thirsty told her not, not to, to do. do. And she ended up getting a taste of what Lucius have already been getting a taste of. She got her hot paws handed to a pop cow. Yep. That's the short version of what happened because a lot happened in that. But we can go talk about all that. Now, we got two pit bulls tied up. Tied up. To a table. One heifer. Got two people tied up. So now all of a sudden, <laughs> them two going at it. Because at first Cookie had came. Yeah, that is important. Let me go back. Oh, yeah. When she when she first came. Yeah. She first came down there. And Lulu played because Claudia basically said, You don't send her try away? I'm going me and I'll kill her. I'm going to slit her neck. So he went ahead and he basically was like, I don't need you. I had to work. Look, I'm here to do my work. I, I need to finish this new song. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. And I, I said, new song. I said, there's signals in there. There's yeah, signals. yeah, uh huh. Cookie, pick up on the signals. So when she pulled off, she got halfway down the road, and she was like, "Hold on, wait a minute. That's he my, lied. that's my song. That's my song. That that's a god darn signal. And the only thing that you had in that car was a god darn shaving razor. What? You got Gucci. You got all that at the same darn time. Huh? But, but you ain't got, you ain't got no peace. And you, and, you know this how, and you know this house was crazy? And Thursday told you it was in a secluded spot? But you it, With only a razor. But then it goes back full circle. Because she had that razor. And I said, mm-hmm. We're going to see that razor come up a little um, later on. And then when Claudia had her tied to the table, when she came back to rescue Lucius, and she got <laughs> all tied to the table, um... Claudia started playing Cookie and Lucius against each other. 
they got into it, but at one time I couldn't tell who was talking. Was it Lulu or Dwight? I knew it was a game because they always do that. They go, they back argue back and forth. Back back forth. She did 17 years. He took care of the kids and did the company. He don't love her no more. She don't love him no more. And Maybe it's betrayal. Maybe it's all this. And it's like, you know what? I still love you, dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So basically, they, they came all the way down to, he ain't good for you. That's why you shouldn't have never been with him. Oh, and you shouldn't have been walking around here with Juliana. She ain't good for you. And da 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 da. And oh, so they pushing up daisies and he dead and da da. So Claudia said, hold on, wait a minute. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Let me go ahead and get this here straight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you heard it right. You heard it right. So everybody that come in between y'all. Uh huh. They end up day. Yep. And they was like, y'all. Just about. <laughs> just about. She took that knife and put it on that table. She said, well, basically, the book stops here. You ain't going to kill me. I'm going to kill y'all. And um, Lulu looked and said, mm -mm, this ain't how it's going to go down. And Cookie said, you know what? I don't care what has ever went down, how much they have betrayed me, mm -hmm. how much my family have betrayed me. I don't been in the pen, and they betrayed me. And at the end of the day, I still love that man. And we move as a unit. When I move, he moves just, just like that. that. And um, this is how it's going to go down. you going to let us go. You're going to do this. You're going to do that. Claudia said, you know what? I ain't got time. She took the guy door a knife and put it up to her neck. And I said, oh, Lord. Cook. Lucy was begging for her life, boy. He was like, no. Like, don't do, don't it, don't do, do it. it. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't trade places with what I've been through. Huh? Don't do it. And I said, this wench is really going to kill Cookie, and I mm -hmm. said, well, no, we I can't was do like, this. We can't kill Cookie right now because you kill Cookie, I might be gone. <sighs> I will be gone because she is, yeah. Yeah, she's a vital part of the show. Very vital part of the show. So, next thing we know, we get an interruption. I thought it was Thirsty coming on the scene. Yeah, me too, uh-huh. He was the only other person that we knew that actually had the address. We should have already known by the horn blow. Because yeah. that, that one, the Cadillac horn. Nah, <laughs> that was not. A Cadillac horn. How Cadillac horn go? How it go? <laughs> I don't it. I don't it. I don't. And, and back in the day, <laughs> back in the day, <laughs> you couldn't hold on a two ball because she'll go. <laughs> I hate you with everything I got in me. <laughs> I can't do this with you. I need another co-host. Who was the now, next see, co host with me? Now see if, if Thursday had came up there, he would never pop. He would have drove right on through that motherfucking house. No. <laughs> Did you ever no, no. <laughs> God damn. Did you ever like not I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow your eyebrows right over the hall. Oh yeah, Thursday would have drove that car right on through the house. So we just gonna pick up right there. Yeah. Just like that. Yeah. No, cause <laughs> Thirsty is a real G. He would have popped at the end of the freaking road. Yeah. And you walked right. up. Yeah, you That's right. what you do. Yeah. You come through and you look through the windows. You make sure that, okay, I see an opening there. So if I get caught up right there, I can go right here. That a, is it a yeah. shotgun house? They would have been, I mean, been wondering how in the world did he get there because they ain't gonna see no cops. Yeah, That's what you say. He's gonna move like ghosts on power. <laughs> no shade, Empire, but <laughs> you better learn. So, um, it was the colleague therapist. She came up there and she told Claudia, she said, you know, do you have Lucius lying in there? She was like, I think you need to go. And she had the crazy look in her eyes. So the therapist knew automatically. He was in there. She on that skit again. She's like, I'm going in the house. I was like, you might not want to like walk with your back turned. Why do we always do? You don't walk. Yeah. You Listen, don't. rabbit hole. Um, back in my clubbing days, you know, uh -oh. um, and I was a party girl. I had a plan. When I went to the parties and to the clubs and whatnot, if I, my back wasn't against the wall, then my feet were on top of a speaker. No other way around it. I see everything. Because I need to be able to have my back towards the wall at all friggin' times. We not doing this. If I'm not on the stage dancing on speakers and all this bullshit and, or on the wall, we not doing it. Because that's how you get your tail handed to you, you know? So, what you ain't going to do. You see all these wood? See, I'm from the country. Everything's a weapon. Oh, yeah. You see them, that wood? 
that's nicely cut up like that, yeah, that's for handling. She could have knocked you in your head with a bees of wood. Yep. And you seen There's an axe in the wood. And they got don't. And it always like in the country. Axe is always in the wood. I was waiting to see an old car with his carburetor hanging out. Or a couple of spare tires laying around somewhere. But no, no. If there had been a swing, that was a tire. <laughs> That's some country stuff for your home. Well, two right? by four on that goddamn rope. And we used to hate when it rained, boy. Because you had to take and tilt the tire over and get the water about the tire. Y'all know anything about that? And I hope that a guy don't snake don't roll up out there on your high Man. bars. So, the, Claudia did what she was supposed to do. I'm going to give her that. She clocked that winch and back off God She tried to tell her. She tried to she, tell her. Get back in your car. She got what leave. she deserved. She really did get what she deserved on that part. Nah, see, the third should have went back to the car and called the police. That's what she should have done. She should have called the police before she even went up there. You know what I mean? If I ain't back in 20 minutes, and I'll call you back 911 operators, 21345, send dispatch. You know I don't what I mean? know. Because she probably been working with her for years and probably, she know, she know, yeah, talk her down. You know, she probably talk off. Because she is, was her therapist, man. Yeah. Once again, crazy people. Can't, don't even worry about it. I see where you're going, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, the whole time, Lucius is trying to get the therapist's attention before she got knocked out. Um, and Cookie said, no, 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 no. Don't do that. I got a plan. And she pulled out the razor blade. I said, all right, come it's on back full through, circle. Yeah. Uh -huh. So by the time Claudia came back in that goddamn ham, Lulu was on the goddamn piano like, hey, and then what? And there was no cookie. Now, in my mind, as Mike B would say, um, if you are loose, you better have a really solid plan and not Very to get solid. your hind paws handed to you exactly because when she, you gotta forget remember this is her trap house yeah literally all the traps she's laid you don't know what it is yep so you better have a good solid plan see first thing see. i would have went to is them got doing tasers the goddamn tranquilizer guns because lucius know where they at yeah they're sitting right there on the goddamn chair but it's still cooking she over there somewhere. Hiding. So square up, square up. Yeah, hiding in the back. I would have got her soon. She walked through the door. Walk up. Yep, soon she came through the door. It was a little tussle in the rustling, and she did get the best of Cookie for a good hot minute. Good hot minute. Yeah. I said, Cookie, I'm so goddamn disappointed in you. Yeah, you ended so up getting tased. You ended up getting your high part. She what? got. Look, I'm so glad that hair was human, because if it was synthetic, that stuff would have drawn up and said, shh. shh, shh. <laughs> <laughs> but that human hair was like, child, I was made for this. Uh -huh. So, Lucius ended up having to, he had a fight with the piano up until the part where he just got the piano leg loose. Yeah, he broke in half. And he was able to clock her upside the head, Claudia that is, and knock her out. And he eventually got, you know, the axe as well. And we thought he was going to chop her in half. But he didn't. Yeah. He I'm glad he didn't, though. Nah, I'm glad Cause he didn't. Because he would have went to jail for that skit. So, then the police came and he basically told, you know, Cookie, <clears throat> she don't determine who I am. I determine who I am. I said, well, who are who you? Who are you? Because that, that's Dwight. And then that nuffer, nuffer. <laughs> that heifer had a nerve when she get in the cop car, be staring like this, like, it ain't over. And with a smirk on her face. Yeah. I would have ran over to that cop car. Bog out. And you know what? She'll get rid right on now. Oh, she gonna get out. Yeah, she'll get rid right on now. She got a good old lawyer with a good old retainer waiting. Oh, that she got on retainer for her. So, anybody, mm, anybody that crazy got it. Really good lawyer. They need to. And it ain't thirsty. But I be thirsty. They could throw a curveball on them and be like, what the hell you doing, thirsty? What the, what the? They better not do no bullshit like that. So, then we gonna switch on over with the boys. Jamal's still struggling. Hakeem eventually was like, you know what, Jamal, get your skid up. Put, Put your, your Gucci on. on. I said, so everybody um, rock, um, representing Gucci this um, season, I ain't mad. I ain't mad. Hey, I'm dude. just not buying the skit. I'm trying to retire, not look fly. I'm just saying. What makes you feel good? Do buddy. whatever makes you feel good. Uh -huh. uh, but feeling good to me is when I retire. Yeah. Um, being free. Being free for real. So... They get up and they go over there to Shady Pines. Well, I don't know if it's called Shady Pines. I don't know what it's called. it is. And we, we, I told Stella, I said, so what they do? Put Andre in a wheelchair and, and just, just roll him out and there? Push him on out there. 
Andre said that. I said, there you go. He, he ain't talking so play. He, he in there. Cling a ling a ling. Uh huh. So they was <clears> like, <throat> so Andre was like, why y'all here? I'll be home next week, you know. You know, is everything all right? You and, you and Warren good? You know, I heard about what's going on. I said, hold on. They can't check on you. Yeah. Why are you we so shot. concerned about, what, but you the old That's friend. Andre, though. That's Andre. Yeah, that's Andre. So then Jamal had a breakdown once he started looking in, um, in Andre's face, and he knew that Andre, well, Andre ain't never really been 100% here with us. Nah. But at this point, we used to get about 70% of Andre yeah. here with us. We got like 40 right now. So he's not satisfied with the 40. And he looked at that boy and he was like, man, man, Diane screwed us all up. I don't kill Castleman T. Diggs. Don't mess you up. Don't mess you, you up. God, look at you. You God. just getting your baby, baby back. I mean, it's just as bust She up, destroyed man. this whole family. And she promised she would and she did. Just, just look at him. Look. Look at his face. <laughs> I, I just said she semi-destroyed him. She didn't destroy she him did. the way that she really wanted to. Yeah. So then Andre was looking at um Jamal like, hell, let me get out of this wheelchair. And, and get, talk to you. And yeah. get you a seat because, bro, you going through it. <gasps> and he told him, he said, you know, we going to get through it. You know, everything's going to be all right. We got each other. We're not. Yeah. And I said, why y'all didn't make them sing Lean On Me? That yeah. would have been a like they did in the elevator to bring back the Lean On uh -huh, Me. Like they did in the elevator. And that would have let start, me. And they start rocking back and forth like Lean. And Andre said, you just call. Oh, my brother. Now, see, think about it, if it had been Orange Radio was consoling, they would have sung that song. Because that song helped him out. Yeah. Yeah. So, I guess at some point we're going to get 70% of Andre back. I, 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 I doubt it, very seriously. I doubt it. Uh, it hasn't have, happened this, did this um, yet, so it ain't going to happen. Mm -mm. He's still buffering, man. He's still buffering. But at the end of the day, we got we got the lay lotions back. Um... AKA Dwight. We 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 in between two stations, as yeah. Stanley would say. And at the end of the episode we saw where um Andre is still he ain't ready to come home next week if you ask me. Nah, he's still fighting and he trying to blow up Lucius. Yeah. Um, and he said, I got to tell him. I got to tell like, him. I was like, no. I said, don't, don't. Don't tell him. There's some things no. that you might just want to take to your God don't agree. Yeah. So next week, it looks like everything. Or, or send it to go. him in an email or a text. Yeah. You know, don't be in his face. <laughs> but I will tell you this. I am so frigging Oh, glad yeah. That we did not have to do a cabin in the woods for more than one day. I was so yeah. scared. We were going to go through the whole wind of this season in that goddamn cabin with them two locked up in that goddamn cabin because mm. I'm I, I won't gonna do it. Mm -mm, I wouldn't even. I won't. I I'm pretty sure none it. of us was gonna do it. Can y'all imagine? Look, 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 all this this music and illusions. Yeah, oh, yeah. Claudia, it'll be just I like, can't it'll been just love like the first you. first half of this season where well, we had no leg illusions for all the way with no leg Dwight, except for the last two three episodes. Then we got. Lucius, some of them. Yeah, we ain't gonna do it. The most we saw when he helped them take out, take out the Dubai, the du, du Dubois, if I can say it right. It's getting late, so you know how that go. Yeah. But anywho, it was it was good. Um, yeah, it was pretty decent. Episode. It kept my attention, and mm -hmm. I think that from you this do, point do on, do better this year right yeah. here. Yeah, I mean, Lee Daniels, we not fit to play with you. So hopefully, he listened to um all of us talking what we said. Ain't gonna make this thing right. Unless he pulling a taller period where and he heals, but he don't heal us. <laughs> I'm straight from the... V hey, I do have this to say. Didn't Cook and Lime, when she first came on there with that guy doing all huh? blonde wig, I said, if you don't come on with giving me to y'all the tail of tea, uh -huh. I said, you better go with ahead. That outfit on, that le with a leather outfit. It won't leather. She had all these, she had all these keys. Uh, yeah, with a hose in I there. I got the keys, keys, keys. Hey, shameless plug. Tiana and Amon. If y'all not watching that freaking show, yeah, get into it. Support that. Support that. And That's we, different. We did a recap on that too. Like everybody said, it's different. It's refreshing. Cause it's and we, normal. And we need to support it. That's black black love for you right there. We gotta support it. Yeah. I, I was I was just telling you. I was telling my um, baby this week. I said we got to the point where freaking drama, reality TV is fun, but real life is boring. 
what they have is real life. So it might not be as exciting as Housewives of Atlanta or or or, or, or whatever. That's exciting. Either. Or whatever else ratchet shows that that I that I don't watch. I'll be honest. I I I have watched like a few episodes of Married to Medicine just to keep up with the storylines of what's going on. But to be honest, I watch everybody's reviews and I kind of get my life off of that. And then I did watch the um the reunions, which were yeah. Oh my god. But so I mm -hmm. ain't watched their episode. So of I'm them, saying um, that, Housewives. that freaking T Allen and them could change the ties of reality TV if we support it. That we don't need drama every time. Yeah, I just want We don't need it. I want to be able to watch TV with my mama, you know what I mean? Without yeah. people cussing, throwing plates. I mean, we just had Black Ink Crew. See, we in a rabbit hole right now. I was just watching Black Ink Crew. Oh, and I saw Sky put in her guy on zipper and made her titties jump as a lie detector test. Yeah. What kind of bullshit. Is, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> that really slipped out because you know all cuss. Look, <laughs> look. Over a man that she ain't even with. Community thing. Yeah. Which we know is it's drama for ratings for the TV show. Yeah. We sick of it. Done. But anyway, straight from the VA. They're doing the South. Holla. Forgive me for my cussing. Saints. Beep. Pray for me.